We all know him, we all hate him. He's creepy, he's grouchy, he's adamant he's not wearing a costume, and the complete opposite of what he should be. I'm talking about the one and only Zipper T-Bunny. And today, we're going to unzip him and find out exactly who is in the yellow rabbit furry suit. It's CEO here, and welcome back to my channel. It's obvious that Zipper is not who he says he is. I've gathered evidence that points to three potential suspects, with the first being Tom Nook. But before I reveal the proof, I wanted to quickly remind you that I'm still hosting a sweepstakes for a $10 Nintendo eShop gift card, and it's super easy to enter. Just download Disney Emoji Blitz for free using my custom link in the description, get to level 10 in the game, screenshot it, and send it over to me on Twitter or Instagram. Plus, anything you spend in the game will go to help support me, as the link is also a creator code, so thank you so much for that. And as a bonus, if 200 of you download the game, the prize increases to a $15 eShop gift card. The sweepstakes ends May 9th, and good luck. The most obvious would be that the T in Zipper T Bunny stands for Tom Nook, but this lore goes even deeper. Zipper wears his signature visor all the time. No other NPCs or villagers default to wearing a visor. The only time we ever see anyone wearing a visor in any Animal Crossing game is Tom Nook for the GameCube. At the end of each month, Tom Nook would hold his bingo-esque raffle, where he would pick your prize by rolling a cage filled with balls until one was released, the same way bingo numbers are picked. Now, why would he be wearing a visor anyway? They are a huge part of bingo culture, and Tom Nook is playing right into that. Raffles and Nook's visor disappeared in Wild World, but guess who made their debut appearance in Animal Crossing City Folk? Zipper, T, Visor, Bunny. Now that is suspicious. It looks like Nintendo purposely took away the raffles to make us forget about Visor version Nook, only to bring back the Visor as part of Zipper's outfit as a homage to his true identity. We can all agree that Zipper is scary, and in Happy Home Designer for the 3DS, Tom Nook has admitted that he embraces people thinking he's scary, especially if it helps get his debtors to pay up. So what better way to practice being scary than in a bright, yellow, creepy costume where his identity is hidden. Zipper's name in Korean is Tobit, which is the same name of a figure who is extremely wealthy in the Bible. And you know who else is super rich? Tom Nook. In Animal Crossing New Leaf, villagers have this rare dialogue where they would speculate that Tom Nook is just a man in a raccoon suit. In Animal Crossing Wild World, even Dr. Shrunk says how we all wear emotional masks, including Tom Nook. But instead of a mask, he wears his raccoon suit. So if Tom Nook really is a man in a suit, then this mystery man would have no problem jumping into another suit for Easter. He would already be used to the feeling and weight of it. This is plausible, because there is a secret backdoor in resident services that mysteriously leads to somewhere unknown. Maybe it's a trap door to the plaza, where Tom Nook could pop out of resident services and into the plaza within a matter of seconds. Or maybe our mystery man wears the Tom Nook suit and the zipper suit at the same time. This would be super heavy to wear, which could be why he visibly sighs and stops bouncing when you leave his field of view. Our second suspect is Tordemir, which could stand for the T in Zipper's name. This tortoise appeared as the mayor in GameCube, Wild World, and City Folk. His old age could explain why Zipper needs to take jumping breaks, but this goes even deeper. In the Animal Crossing anime movie, Tordemir is the mayor with a huge ego. He even talks like a cult leader and constantly reminds the town that he is the one in charge. He takes it even farther by shooting fireworks in the sky in the shape of his own face. But as we progress to the Animal Crossing games, Tordemir has become less and less important. So what better way to relive his egomaniac days than to jump into a bright yellow bunny suit that you can't ignore? Under last suspect, you may not have guessed. He looks strikingly similar to Zipper T Bunny. He lives underwater, he's bright yellow, he's got buck teeth, and brings nonsense wherever he goes. So who do you think is really in the Zipper costume? Let us know in the comments. Subscribe and like this video to show your support for more Animal Crossing theories like this one. And if you like this video, watch my minigame update video next. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.